Hey, it's Dr. Karras from Karras Health and Chiropractic, and today we're going to be talking about supplements. I'm not going to be talking about the quality of supplements, but I'm going to be talking about the amount of supplements that you should be taking. A lot of people come in and are taking supplements, but when I ask them how much of a certain supplement they're taking in grams or milligrams or IUs, depending on the type of supplement, then they're typically not taking enough of that supplement to help with the condition that they're taking the supplement for. And so today, today I'm going to be using omega-3s as, as an example. You know, a lot of people come in and they're taking omega-3s. The fish oil is what they're, what they're known as. And I did a video on omega-3s, the benefits of taking them, and there's a, there's a ton of benefits to taking omega-3 fatty acids, and I'm not going to be talking about that today. You can watch my omega-3 fatty acid and inflammation video. I'll have that posted in the link below. But we're just going to be talking about the amount of omega-3s that you should be taking. Now, omega-3 is a fish oil, but specifically, the type of fish oil you want to get is the EPA and the DHA. And so that's docosapentaenoic acid and docosahexaenoic acid. You don't have to know that word, you just have to know EPA and DHA is what you're looking for. Now, typically, when someone's taking a fish oil, they should be getting between 1 and 3 grams of fish oil a day. Now, the, the confusion comes in when you're looking at the front of a, a fish oil supplement it's gonna say you know 1200 milligrams of fish oil or one gram of fish oil 1.2 grams of fish oil whatever it says in the front that can be misleading even though it says 1200 milligrams of fish oil on the front you have to flip the the container over and you have to look at the back and now the the two different concentrations I want you to look at are EPA and DHA EPA like I just said is one of the good fish oils in DHA. So you want to find the amounts on the fish oil on the back. And then you calculate how much those are in total for one supplement. So one pill in here has 360 milligrams of EPA and it has 240 milligrams of DHA. So you add those together, that's 600 milligrams, 0.6 grams. And the goal, like I said, you want to get one to three grams of fish oil. So even though it says 1,200 milligrams on the front of fish oil, that's not actually correct because you want to calculate these. So it's actually only 600 milligrams of fish oil that you're getting in one pill. So to get over one gram of fish oil, you would have to take two of these a day. I would recommend taking at least two or three a day if you're going to use these um, for any health benefit. And typically, another thing to look for is when people make supplements, one container of supplements is generally for one month. So this has 60 capsules of fish oils in it. And then when you look at the back, there's 600 milligrams of EPA and DHA. So two of those a day, which would be 1.2 grams, which you get, get you in the one to three gram level of fish oil a day, is what's in here. So typically, the companies will make these containers for a one month supply. Now a lot of people, what happens is they come in and they'll get one of these and it'll say 60 capsules on it. So they'll think that's good, it'll stretch them out if they take one a day, that will stretch them out for two months. But the problem is they're not getting the right amounts of the fish oil. And this doesn't happen just for fish oil, it's for any other supplement out there. So the biggest thing is you need to first find out what concentration of a certain supplement you need, and then second you need to calculate in that individual product how many of those you have to take to reach that level. If you're not doing that, then odds are you're not going to see the benefit that you want to see by taking a certain supplement. So get out your fish oils, and obviously you want to find a really good, high-quality fish oil. If you're not doing that, then you're just cheating yourself. If you're going to a local store and you're not getting a good quality fish oil, then you're not going to get the benefit in general. But get the fish oil out, calculate how much EPA, DHA is in one capsule, and figure out how many of those capsules you have to take a day to get you in the 1 to 3 gram area for that given day for that supplement but it goes for all supplements you should have a certain amount so go home and look at your supplements and if you have any questions give me a call get, shoot me an email and uh, let me know and also if you've been taking a certain supplement that's really been helping you out email me and let me know or write on the blog and let me know what's been helping you out because we'd love to hear from you and see what's helping you out this is Dr. Karras from Karras Health and Chiropractic